Whew, I don't even know where to begin with this one, guys. I've seen a lot of stupid pro players in my time say some very stupid things. And to be quite honest with all of you, just a fresh take out there as well. This revolving around Call of Duty pro player known as Mutex, who has now recently been kicked from the Dallas Empire regarding some streaming clips, which we talked about this morning. He referred to a teammate of his in a very demeaning manner uh, towards some words that were very choice words of mental handicaps that were used. And I was going to defend the guy. I was actually going to sit down here at, at a certain point point in time and say he deserves a punishment maybe not to be fired or kicked from the team he has now been kicked from the team and I, uh, I I think based off his response he deserved it if you guys have not seen his response just take a listen take a listen to his response little message to Dallas Empire yo I appreciate the opportunity I deadass appreciate the opportunity. It sucks I couldn't have made you guys the best SND team in the world and potentially the best team in the world because good luck finding anyone better than me. Like genuinely, like genuinely, good luck. Like you're never gonna find anyone as valuable as me when it comes to search and destroy and the passion behind Call of Duty. Good luck guys, I understand the shitty position. Realistically speaking, man, it is a big hell for you guys, I'm not gonna lie. It, you guys lost a huge how can you as a pro player be this idiotic i i am baffled right now and i the only way to take away from the tension right now that i'm feeling the pressure i'm feeling is a guy like methods who i think I, I think rightfully so methods actually just nailed this one of the funniest cod clips i have seen probably for a long time and, and here that is here's methods response to how mutex is is reacting to this and i, I think it captures it just about perfectly Guys, I'm so sorry. I know I just completely destroyed my entire career. You will never find someone as experienced and as good at S&D than me. Dallas Empire, this is an elf. I'm so sorry, guys. The amount of disrespect I displayed on stream, it will, you guys will never be successful without me. I don't understand what is going through your head. Obviously a very stressful moment in your life where yes, you were caught saying something you should not be saying as a pro player. You get fired for doing so. You still have a career ahead of you. Keep that in mind. At that point in time, once you are fired, you still, as a pro player, you have the talent and the skills to make a career ahead of you. And you can actually, you can right the wrongs. You can move on from this. And then after apologizing time and time again, you posted what? Three or four apologetic videos, four to five apologetic tweets you're retweeting people defending you about how sorry you were and then you have the goal you have the absolute balls to actually come out and say oh yeah I'm sorry but man you guys are gonna regret this there's no one better than me you guys that's a big old L that's a big old L man I was so sorry though our how dumb can you be? And I think you guys know I don't usually get this angry over these kind of things, but this is your career on the line and you sit down and you record yourself saying this stuff and you actually think this will work. Yeah, another organization out there that's participating in the Call of Duty League or maybe just in future events at all, they're going to see this, guys. They're going to see my response to being sorry for the things I said, but they're also going to see this video where I say, that's a big L, Dallas Empire, and they're going to say, that Mutex, man? Man, he's got some big, he's got some big cahoons, man. Let's, let's sign that player because he said Dallas Empire, that's a gigantic L. Yeah, that's a player I want on my team. Oh, he said some choice words and he was caught out saying some bad things publicly. Oh, man. That's the kind of guy I want because you know why? Based off all that stuff, throw that away. He, according to himself, is one of the best S&D players on God's well-made earth. Yes, let's sign that guy. I cannot believe that you actually sat down to yourself and you thought, hmm, what's going to save my career? Let's call out the organization that fired me and say they're not going to find a single better player out there. Are you actually serious right now, Mutex? I'm going to go cool off, and I hope some other players out there cool off. Huge shouts to Methods. I've never laughed that hard at my desk, at least not this year. You really put a smile on my face around this entire situation, which I think needs a few more smiles out there. I'll be back here tomorrow, guys, breaking down other news, including a, hopefully a follow-up story on this one. I expect now Hastro and Dallas Empire to respond about this, and you gave them a clear, easy-cut reason as to why they cut you with all of this. Now, it could be their, their hand might have been forced in the first place because you could have actually possibly broken some rules in the Call of Duty League rulebook, which, by the way, has not even started yet you couldn't make it that far so their hand could have been forced and it couldn't have been not even their decision to fire you but now with your response you made it seem that they made the obvious right choice in doing so an incredibly stupid moment incredibly stupid i'm gonna go home hope you guys all enjoy i'll see you back here tomorrow <laughs>